So there's a YouTube channel called Strider7x, who, uh, a lot of his, he does Paper Mario, the old N64 Paper Mario RPG game, um, and a number of his videos, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say a third to a half of his videos are some, everything crashes Paper Mario. Just the most random thing in the world. Okay, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say I win this match. Not the game, the match. Um, the most random things in the world crash Paper Mario. And so we were talking about well, crashing MTGO. Well, he could figure out a way. If anyone could, he could figure out a way. Alright. Let me see if I have a, a line here. Okay. This is Ooh, neat. I think I'm just gonna... I'm gonna keep... Take your free margin. Oh, okay. Yeah, so you reveal your hand... Yeah. I mean, it, it's yeah. visibly exiled. So Do I exile that or just... Yeah, you exile that and the rest of your hand. Oh. So if you do that, you lose the rest of your hand. You usually did do that to dig for a Sarah Sanctum or a crop rotation into Sarah Sanctum. Oh. Um, so if you have a Sarah Sanctum, you, mm -hmm. you pretty much keep... Okay. So like for this hand, it would be Leyline, Leyline... Yeah, um... This is really slow. You you you're good to to ditch it. So that was that was a good ditch. Absolutely, ten out of ten, ditch. <laughs> okay. Uh, usually when I do that, I just pick the next seven. But you, oh. you're doing it correctly. You're doing okay. it correctly. <laughs> uh, it's all good. It's a technical mulligan. <laughs> it is technically a mulligan. Okay, so this one puts you back to seven. <laughs> okay. Alright, see what you got. Actually, I guess I won't see what you got. Okay, uh, free game effects? Alright. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you have Sarasanctum Opalescence, you win the game right now. <laughs> Do you? No. Do, 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 okay, 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 okay. About to say, because that is a turn one kill if you have that. Five ley lines, Sarasanctum Opalescence, you win. <laughs> Good day, sir. Okay, so I have no grave, creatures can't be countered, you have hexproof, you can cast your stuff with flash, and your creatures gain one toughness and you gain one life whenever a creature enters under your control. Spoiler alert, there are zero creatures in the deck. <laughs> The only way that part matters is if you have opalescence and then play a ley line after that. <laughs> okay, so now that we have all of this gobbledygook out of the way, now what would you like to do? I guess you don't have to do anything. You have a ley line of anticipation. You could just wait. <laughs> all right. You were on the play. Though. I am on the play, aren't I? That's effects. right. That's right. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, in that case. That, that changes things a, a might just a little bit. Let's see. One, two... Mm, three, four... That's... An, that's enough. We're, we're gonna go for it and see how we... how we do, if we get there. We won't, but we're gonna pretend. Uh, exile Elder Spirit Guide and Simeon Spirit Guide to make two mana. Mm -hmm. Paretic Ritual, three mana. Seething Song, five mana. Chrome Mox, imprinting nothing. Empty the Warrens. So Storm is four. Well, Storm is three plus the Empty the Warrens. I have eight Google Tokens. That's what they're called. And this is in the grave. I have eight Googles. Past turn. That's all. Come on, men. Nobody lives forever. That, that should be a goblin flavor text. If it's not, it should be. Oh, gah. Oh, <laughs> serum, serum powder, because serum powder. Go ahead. This deck has an uncanny ability. Are they ones ability. or two twos? I can't remember. Are they? They're one ones. Oh, okay. That's why I'm putting them all in once. 
<laughs> Why not? I mean, what else am I gonna do? I'm gonna make a smiley face out of them. That's what I'm gonna do. You're welcome. Okay. okay. Swing eight. Alright, fast turn. <laughs> Nailed it. I'm having a good time. In case that weren't obvious. Go ahead. I'm not tap I'm not turning that again. <laughs> Swing eight. Yep. Pass turn. Jesus. There it is. Yep, you got me. <laughs> you know, Jay, if you had been a little wiser about it, just a little bit, <laughs> you would have kept one goblin back. <laughs> I am tired. It is, what, 11 some odd? I am tired. No. All right. Yeah, we're doing this again. J, J, and <laughs> T1 Glycerol punted super hard. So let's try this again. Alright, see what seven I got. One, two, three. Three. Five. Okay, we're good. We're keeping. No. Nope. All right. <laughs> Oops. It's okay. It's not the end of the world. So in the meantime, I'm going to name this one Huey and Dewey and Louie. Donald... Scrooge, okay, thank you. <laughs> oh! Uh, no! I did see that card. Alright, let me shuffle a bit to make up for that. Shuffle, shuffle. And Daisy, so we're at six. Um, that one guy that flies their airplane. <laughs> I can't remember his name. But apparently they have a pilot. Alright, there we go. See what six grants you. I'm still. I still can't believe I attacked with every one of them. <laughs> I cry every time. Oh. It made sense the first time, I suppose. More on the draw. Yep. Try and keep this. Yeah, because it relies on pregame effects so much, it's really hard to go below six. All right, pregames. Okay, meek anticipation, life vitality. Okay. okay, so none of them do anything, basically. Alright, cool. We're gonna do uh, Elvish and Simeon. Mm -hmm. So we're making two mana. We're gonna first spend it on Mana Morphos, and we're gonna make red-green again. So draw a card. We're gonna look at your hand. Yeah, yeah, we're gonna look at your hand. I see Opalescence, Crop Rotation, Serum Powder. Yeesh! You had a Serum Powder. You actually could have gone six again. I mean, it would be six, not seven, but nevertheless. All right. Land Grant, let me show you my hand. Can we get a Taiga? All right, cool. You're in here somewhere, buddy. I have one land in here. Still with red-green floating. Do -do 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 -do. Hey, there we go. If it happened to be the top card... That would be just my luck. Just my luck. Boink. Okay, cool. Sweet! Okay. So anyway, spin the green on a tender wall. 
Pop the tender ball for red, so there's triple red floating. Uh, now there's quintuple red floating. And we'll spend three of it on a burning, or two of it on a burning wish, leaving three. Burning wish gets a sorcery out of the yard. We're going to get an empty of the warrens. We're going to play the chrome mox for nothing but extra storm. Taiga, tap. You're exiled, by the way. Empty the warrens. So, let's do a price check here. Manamorphose, Contaxian Probe, Land Grant, Tenderball, Seething Song, Burning Wish, Empty the Warrens. Oh, Chrome Mox, Ooh. Empty the Warrens. So by my count, that ends up being... Eight. Let's see, eight. Okay, cool. We ended up with that. Yay. I'm going to put twos on all of them now, and then I'll pass the turn. <laughs> Gonna put two twos out. Oh, gee. Okay. Yeah. Uh, game three in the most interactive game of Magic you will ever see in your life. All right. Take three. Now this time I assume you want to be on the play. Yep. All right. Cool. Point. Get that turn one win. Ta da! Ta da! Ta da! Okay. Mm. This is a thing. Ooh. I I'll keep. I think I'll just go to six here. Alright. You don't have a sanctum or a crop rotation for a sanctum? Man. <gasps> I know this This is one of the reasons why the deck can't ever be top tier, it's inconsistency is, even with four sanctums, four crop rotations, four serum powders to get said sanctums and rotations, it still has this problem, in abundance. Abundance right. is near point. I, I don't know. <laughs> because Rebecca Gay is an artist for it. I'm only aware of Rebecca Gay doing the art. Um, for the card. She's Ooh. maybe my favorite. No, no, definitely my favorite in the game's history. Close second to, I guess it's, is it Stephen Argyle does Glistener Elf? Oh, man. I should know this. I should know this. I should know this. Pulling it up right away while you take your, uh, while you mull. Yeah, I'll keep this, I guess. Alright. How can I call myself a T1 Glycerin? It's Steve Argyle. Okay, cool. We're good on that. We got this. <laughs> double Sanctity, Double Punishment, and Vitality. With one card left over. Pass turn. Okay. <laughs> well, spoiler alert. Alright. Lotus Petal. Pop it. Green. Tender Wall. Pop it, red, 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 well, this was this was dumb. Yeah. Um, that's a thing, I guess. Did you do sideboards? No. All right. So odds get much worse for me when Chancellor of the NX comes in in place of three Leyline of the Meek and a suppression. Mm, suppression field is tricky because that actually can stop Charvelcher. Maybe an idyllic tutor. It's three mana after all. You don't want to go down on too many ley lines. But yeah, that's uh that's this deck. That's this dumb matchup.